With the Running Dynamics Pod, you have a convenient way to get detailed measurements and stats that help improve your running form. Before using your Running Dynamics Pod for the first time, you need to pair it to your watch. The Running Dynamics Pod sleeps when not in use. To wake up the pod, shake it a few times vertically. Note that in typical use, the pod will wake up automatically when you start walking or running. To pair the pod, bring it very close to the watch when the watch is in run mode. A message will appear to let you know the pod is connected. Once paired, the Running Dynamics pod will now connect automatically with the watch at the start of your runs. The Running Dynamics pod should be worn clipped to the center back of your waistband. This is the only correct way to wear the pod. Centered on the back, vertical, with the logo facing out. The pod should not be rotated, or off to one side, or facing inward. It is also important that the pod is correctly oriented inside the clip. The running man icon should be right side up when the pod is being worn. The pod also won't work properly if it is worn elsewhere on the body, such as the front of the waistband, carried in a pocket, or clipped to the shoe. The pod is so small and lightweight that it's easy to forget and leave it on your running gear, but you should avoid washing the pod in the washing machine. The pod should withstand infrequent accidental machine washing at a medium or cool temperature. Frequent machine washing, hot washing temperatures, or the dryer may damage the pod. Your watch will remind you at the end of your run to remove the running dynamics pod. Some runners attach the pod to the band of their watch at the end of their runs so they don't forget about it. Thanks for watching. Check out the other videos in this series for information about using your running dynamics pod including how to replace the battery when the time comes.